We have a heartwarming update to a story we first brought you back in May. You may remember the Anderson County mom known as the litter lady. She picks up trash constantly on the side of the road, but she didn't have enough space in her Jeep to haul off all that debris. After that original story aired, an anonymous viewer knew he needed to help the litter lady out in a big way, and he delivered that much needed gift. Katie Inman was there for the life changing surprise. Brandy Brogdon crammed a lot of litter into trash bags this past year. Now, if you're asking me for a total, uh, I couldn't tell you. This Anderson County mom, who's known as the litter lady, never stopped. A month ago, she made a plea to the public asking for help to get an old truck to haul more trash. The truck that I was expecting, I was like an 80s model beat up Chevrolet. Throw your stuff in the back, tie it down, tarp it, and take it to the dump. That's when the community and an anonymous Knox County man stepped in to help. He matched donations up to $10,000. <gasps> but nothing could have prepared her you say that? <laughs> for what drove down the road and into her life on Monday. She couldn't get a look fast enough at her new truck. Oh, my God. <laughs> a moment Brandy will never take for granted. Oh. I'm going to cry. I'm going to cry. <sighs> because of the shortage, it took over a month for the donor to find a truck that would also be safe and reliable for Brandy's family. Just to see how it feels to throw it in there. Look how much room I still have. That's three times the room that my Jeep has, at least. This 2017 Nissan truck from Gilrith Auto Sales in Strawberry Plains is a lot more than Brandy bargained for. Oh my goodness. A gift basket filled with goodies in the back seat was the cherry on top. An emergency roadside kit. You cannot ever be too prepared. New wipers if I need them. A life-changing gift that will help her help others. The lesson in all of this is that one person can make a difference. She's officially closing the door on the Jeep that helped her start as the litter lady. It's a big difference. It's, I mean, it's tremendous difference. It would save me time and effort and energy. And so it's just kind of a big deal. <laughs> now she won't have to worry about whether she'll have to leave any litter behind. I'm ready to get to work. I'm ready to get to work. Let's go. Let's pick some litter up. In Anderson County. My heart is racing. I'm so thankful. I'm Katie Inman. Brandy wants to say thank you to everybody who made this possible. If you'd like to be a part of the Litter Lady community, Brandy has a Facebook page that you can join. We have that link on our website.